members of the media, invited guests, ladies and gentlemen, and of course our recipients, Bula and a good day to you all. As soon as I came out of my vehicle, my CEO and the acting chair and also the board member was surprised uh, to see me with a tie and long sleeve. Well, normally I'm a bula man. I wear a bula shirt. Because I was engaged in uh, the annual award stay at uh, Mahatma Gandhi Memorial High School, so I had to wear. Ladies and gentlemen, today is a historical day for Housing Authority. And of course, for all the Fijians. And I will tell you the reasons as I'll go along. I'm delighted to be amongst you here today to present the offer letters for housing lots here in the Tadirua for Tadirua customers. 113 customers are being presented the offer letters today. Fiji's homeless deserve roofs over their heads. And your government is determined to work in partnership with those who share our vision. The Constitution compels us to meet this objective, and we will. Majority of these customers present here have been renting while some live in squatter settlements, and others are staying at government quarters and even at public rental flats. But now I'm happy to say that these people can build their own homes. We have ensured that fairness and transparency prevails, which is the reason why lots have been allocated to those who had already registered their interest and due diligence was also done through expression of interest for their eligibility, such as income, whether they are the first-time homeowners, and their eligibility for a land and a house package. The average size of these housing lots ranges from 215 to 554 square meters. Those who are present here, please let me know if you come across and if you are aware or if you know that there are people who have got lots with housing authority but they are still getting one. The reason why I'm saying this, because you people are the best people to let us know in terms of eyes and ears on ground. As Minister for Housing, at times I receive complaints. But let me tell you one thing, we will deal with all those cases if there is such case exists. I can assure all the Fijians that there is no such practice now at Housing Authority. <coughs> Ladies and gentlemen, government has introduced a number of innovative ideas for affordable homes, and I'm happy that the Housing Authority is progressing government's vision very well. Ladies and gentlemen, in a few days' time, we will present offer letters to customers in the Western Division in Mataboli Boli Nendi. I'm also very happy to announce that Housing Authority is going to develop many land development subdivision projects for low to middle income groups, Fijians, in near future. For example, Davi Lebu, which will have 704 lots, Tawakumbu in Lutoka with 533 lots, and uh, the contracts for this project uh, has been awarded, and the construction works will commence in few weeks' time. For Tavua, which has got 119 lots, are in the final stages of negotiation 
and will commence soon. Nepani project is also nearing completion by first quarter of 2018, which has got 172 lots. Vaikomba project will also commence by beginning of second quarter of 2018 with 800 lots. Strata development with 736 units of one, two, three bedrooms, principal of community living to provide even better and improved living environment will also be happening soon. But I was a bit disturbed. Some two weeks ago, I have read some commentaries by some political pundits that government is not doing enough in terms of affordable houses. The only message or the only thing that I can say to those such political pundits that they don't know what's happening in and around in this country. What I have said is, it takes time. You need to purchase the land first. Then you need to do the scheme. Then the engineering plan. Tender for consultants. These are simple things. But sometimes we need to tell public that these are the process that has to take place before you get a fully service loss. <coughs> so I would urge those political pundits, <coughs> if they want to make comments on affordable houses, please call me. My number is 9929438 and I'll tell them what is all about these affordable houses and what we are doing as a government. I assure you all, that with the efforts of government, quality of life of Fijians will improve. The subdivisions that I've mentioned and the lots that I have mentioned in those subdivisions is apart from the subdivision that is carried out by squatter unit within my department. There's another thousands of sub, uh, lots will be subdivided and given to the informal settlement with 99 years lease. I'm also very happy to say that this is the first time in the history of Housing Authority that so many projects will be running at the same time. On this note, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to commend the Housing Authority in particular, the board, the management, the staffs, providing access to housing solution for all Fijians. And I would like to congratulate the very dear customers, the recipients, and their families who have been presented offer letters here today. Minaka, and thank you.